As time continues to change, so does the music that people find relatable and interesting. People's opinions on the change of music varies because some people find today's music vulgar and negative, while others may think it's evolving positively. I like and listen to a lot of different genres, um, from hip hop to pop, R&B, um, classical, I listen to jazz, really, really anything. If it's good, I, I, I listen to it. My favorite genre is rap and hip hop. Um, I like neo soul, I like jazz, um, gospel music, um, things like that. I don't like all that hip hop today because I don't really know what they're saying. <laughs> the difference between older music and newer music, the lyrics and the beat. Yeah, because like, because the, the beats, the music, the beats to the music back then, like the music back then, it was like mellow. But now people like, they like use drill raps and stuff now, and the lyrics are more, you feel me, explicit and violent and stuff. I don't want to say it's better or worse, it's just, it's just different. And I mean, it's always going to be kind of weird adjusting to something that's different than you're used to. So I mean, I feel like it's good in the fact that it's different and people are doing their own thing. But I also still respect and you know have a have a passion for the old hip hop too. So I mean it's cool. It's kind of like mediocre, kind of run not saying run down, but it's just like uh, more so you really don't know what what's being said, or what's the message. They don't have a message today. So I mean that's the that's the big thing of music of today. Not you don't have Marvin Gaye anymore with what's going on or. Earth, Wind, and Fire, you don't have those people anymore. You just have these little bootsy, little somebody out, you know, and they're not giving a message to younger generations. Many people and older artists believe that music has taken a left turn when it comes to death and lyrical complexity. An example of this is when rapper Ice-T called Soulja Boy out on his hit song, Crank That, due to his controversial opinions. I think older artists, they should, uh, a voice their opinion about uh, music of today because half the people they they sampling off the older artists anyway, you know. So you gotta you gotta take that into consideration because they they kind of like made the way for them to have the new generation of music and things like that today. So yeah, their opinion matters, absolutely. I think that if they don't like, they just fall off because like there's a certain sound nowadays that I mean if you don't have it uh, people really will notice that and you just don't get played. I don't think people are changing their style because I feel like once you once you stick to one style you'll stick to that style for however long you do it for. Ultimately Music changes at the request of the world and the people. Whatever problems are being faced or whatever trends are being set in the moment will always affect music production. However, it's the people that technically control the music produced because we are the consumers. More in perspective because I do listen to a lot of different stuff. So I just, I just hope it, it turns around a little bit as far as like the hip hop scene and like uh, what's acceptable and what's not and like how people uh, view, view hip hop. Be yourself, man. That's that's probably the best thing you could do is just be yourself and do you. Um, that's all music is, that's all art is, is just being yourself and expressing yourself. So as long as you do that, then you're going to be good. Reporting from FSM News, I'm Jalen Johnson.